is basically a gold mine of phrases. This might just be the best wording or combination of wording to use in an AI image prompt. Check out how realistic, unique, and creative these AI images are. And now when they're converted to AI video, look at this. If you know what I mean when I step on this scene, I create my own team. Wow, how did you make these, Eric? Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to do this. And again, some of my most realistic, impressive images come with a simple, least complex sort of method. Sometimes less is more, am I right? That's true, and that is exactly where we're going to begin. But also, make sure you stick around because I'm going to show you some amazing tips and tricks you definitely have to try. Ho, ho, ho! Subscribe to Metrics Mule. And again, like I said before, it's so simple, it's almost at like an embarrassing level of simplicity and impressiveness all combined in the one. But again, that doesn't even really matter because sometimes I think we try to make prompt magic happen in some of the most complex ways. Sometimes simple and sometimes less is more. So in the past, we may have started this protocol with this right here. There's gonna be two phrases. Here's the first one, the most photorealistic image in the world world. But again, you can only use this so much. This is where we're going to take things up to a much more impressive and unique level. So I mentioned we're going to have two phrases. Now here's the first one. We'll come back to the second one in a second. So just to begin and show you something, let's go ahead and open up Midjourney very quickly just to show you how powerful that this prompt can actually work. Very simple. The most photorealistic image in the world. Put this in just to see what you get. Then if you like it, you can start adding a comma or a colon and then specifically putting in a subject. But look at this, as I scroll down, now I'm in mid journey, this also works well in free pick. You can see how I'm using some different variations in like an image like that, look at that. And now I'll show you how to get these in a second. It's all done with these very creative and unique phrases. But wait until you see what we're about to do at the end of this video. At the end, the tips and tricks we're going to use, I think are really going to blow your mind. Okay, so moving on, let's now generate the second phrase. Now, you may have seen these before, but just in case, here is the second one. The most photorealistic image ever taken. It's going to operate and perform similar to the first one. And now when it comes to the first one, here it is right here, where I said the most photorealistic image in the world. Okay. Again, you can't argue against that. Incredible levels of realism and detail. Now, if we go with the second variation and say image ever taken, it will perform somewhat similar, but let's just see what happens. Okay. And I can add this again and put a colon this time and say supercar. And that's how you can start adding your own specific subjects. But like I said, this isn't even the video today because what we're gonna do is actually go to a grand finale. And that's gonna be in the form of starting to combine these amazing phrases. So let's go ahead and upgrade this very quickly. Here is upgrade number one, the most photorealistic and unique photo in the world. Look at what we got with this right here. But then we're going to come back and I'm going to show you this amazing trick. Now, back in mid journey, look what happens when I said the most photorealistic image in the world, colon, and then I specified my subject, supercar. But now let's go ahead and try an upgraded version. The first one, the most photorealistic and sharpest image ever taken. I'm not giving it a subject right now. And now I'll enter in the second upgrade, the most photorealistic and neat photo in the world. All right, that's gonna be the second upgrade. Let's generate both of these at the same time. Okay, so both these images have just completed. Look how amazing these images turned out, incredible. Now remember, you can also start to add your subject at the end, but now it's time for the grand finale. We're gonna take both of the phrases we just tried and really start to turn things up. But before I do that, let me give you now a bonus phrase to use. Check this out right here, award-winning document documentary photograph. I mean, these all perform incredibly well. Now let's go to the grand finale. And now for this, we're going to go to chat GPT. Now I'm using chat GPT, but any LLM will work. Here is what we're going to do now. Paste something in like this. Okay. Very simple. When I use these phrases in the beginning of my AI image prompts, I get some of the most photorealistic, unique, and creative images ever. Based on these phrases, now provide me with similar and 
even better ones to use. Remember all those phrases we were just using? Let's go ahead and try some of these. We're gonna bring in all these phrases we were using. There's that first one. Let's go ahead and put in two more. That's gonna be our number two. And now we'll go ahead and just do number three, which was gonna be one of the first ones that we did. The most photorealistic image ever taken. Okay, and it does look like I'm actually missing one, the most photorealistic image in the world. So we're actually gonna have four phrases in total. Okay, there we have it. Somewhat similar but all completely different. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and now submit this. Let's see what we get, but then we're gonna take it even one more step. Okay, here we have it. Those opening phrases are powerful prompt amplifiers. But now look at this. Here's a list of even stronger, more cinematic, and creativity-driven alternatives that you can use. This is basically a gold mine of phrases. It's giving me not just one, two, or three, it's breaking it down into different series from ultra realism starters right here. Cinematic artistic excellence, creative superchargers, scientific precision, authentic capture, experimental awe-inducing starters. This is amazing. Using all of these either alone as a standalone prompt or actually adding a subject after the first sentence, your images are gonna look incredible. But look at this down here at the very bottom. It's always important to answer the question, would you like me to generate another list? Let's just say yes to see what happens because this says it's specialized for AI image realism tools and it says Midjourney, Leonardo, Sea Dream, Flux, etc. Look at that right here. How to use, place one of these at the start of your prompt followed by your subject. Here's an example. This is gonna be amazing. And now we're gonna get all of these. Photorealism, cinematic, optical, language, hidden realism tokens. I'm telling you right now, you're gonna be able to generate some of the best images you've ever generated before. Now, one last secret, okay? Let's just say for an example, we like this cinematic artistic excellence one. Copy everything, okay, all five. Down here below, now say this. We're gonna say generate sample prompts for each Okay, then we're going to say, make sure to add additional meta tokens like cameras, lenses, lighting, etc. Okay, now hit that shift enter. Now paste in all five of the ones that it gave us right here. Now hit submit. Watch this right here. Now, up until now, what I just did in ChatGPT is solely responsible for generating some of my personal and most impressive AI images and videos I've ever seen. And now look at this, here it is, it's going to work. We're getting all five. Cinematic masterpiece that feels more real than reality itself. Perfect optical realism. All five of these are going to really blow your mind. Okay, so there you have it. Some of the most realistic, creative, and unique images I think that you can ever create, but then the ultimate cheat code will actually be combining like three or four meta tokens into one paragraph prompt. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I'd love to hear about some of your prompts. In fact, share some of your most impressive prompts in the comments below. I'd love to see how they turned out myself. And remember, if you like this video, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. I'll see you next time. Subscribe to the new, yeah, you already know. Click the links below, let the algorithm glow. I'm the prompt star, welcome to the show. Type one line, watching the empire grow. I'm the prompt star.